Well, I'm back again. It's a few days later now, and uh, I've been busy uh, with those pages. I will get them for you. With those pages. Um, but I discovered I don't have enough vellum. So, and, uh, well, I'm living in a um, little town where there's no... Uh, no shop where I can buy it, so, um, and I don't want to wait much longer, so I think I will think of something else. So this, uh, those four pages are with vellum, and I made, oh, I'm busy with another few pages. Um, I'm busy with this one. And this are a few new ones. And uh, well what I'm doing now is um, I'm doing it different. I have um, a piece of well it's 180 grams paper so it's uh, not 80 it's 100 it's well sturdy enough it's not as thick as uh, the 12 by 12 papers but it's good enough and I have those uh, yeah how do you call them those sleeves in which yeah, which you can do in uh, the maps with those rings and uh, I use it's it's um, you have them in different uh, thickness but this is well really normal so what I'm going to do is um, or what I did is um, with the pages um, which the pocket is on. I will use an A4 like so and a piece of that stuff and I will cut it here to make it even and then I cut it Do it the other way. I cut it. Like so. This is this is what I'm going to use on this page. And this I'm going to make it wider. So I'm doing that in a different way such a page without the pocket. I could sew pockets on it though. No, I don't. Um, I do it in a different way. I do it this way. I take an A4 and I cut that the width of the that's nine and a half inch so it's a bit less uh, the knife is not so sharp anymore well and I can do a whole one and I can cut it in two or in, even in three what I want and then I get another one Do the same. I can do it this way. And I do the 
person with, oh yeah, I will show you this first. Um, well, you can cut it in pieces and I can cut a little piece of this. Right, so if I want to have the whole page like this, I did it like so here. Yeah, a big piece and a little piece. Um, well, let's do this in three. I just cut it. Well, I'm not going to measure it. I'm going to eyeball it. Almost. And the third one I will do later. So this one and this one I should get a new knife. It's not. And I have one over here, but that's too too small. Yeah. And I will measure that. Like so. So I do the pockets different. Well, I think it's not the knife, but the paper. It's a bit soft, I think. And this one over there. And then I'm Another sleeve, two sleeves, and I do it like so. Just measure it. I hope you can see it. Yeah, like so. And cutting this piece. That's this one. And cutting this one. And I do it with the other one too, with a new sleeve. So those are the three pieces. And I do it this way. Well, you can glue it on, but well, I'm not sure how um, sturdy that is. So I'm sewing it, but first I'm uh, sorry. I'm going to sew this like so. Three sides, of course, and then I have a pocket like this. A loose pocket. I could sew it on the the page itself, but uh, well, then you have the sewing on the other side, and I don't like that, so I'm doing it this way. It's more. Uh, solid then and you have a pocket more 
so so I'm going to show this off camera so I'll be right back so I show this yeah and now I'm going to glue it on the page over the sewing oh. just gluing it on like this hold it for a while I'm going to do it with that one and with that one the same on this page and this one I'll still do it with the vellum I have not with little uh, pouches like so I'm not going to do that because uh, well it's way too much work <laughs> So I'm going to do that with the vellum. I have, still have little pouches here. So that is what I'm going to do for the rest of the pages. And I hope you understand now how I did that. Then you get these pouches in which you can stuck behind and the first layer and the second layer you have three layers three pockets if you want to the first two you don't see but well it's double you can do it um, single of course but you have this one and then this is the second one and this is behind the purple one you can do it like so too if you want to uh, I'm going to do this one this one well every one every uh, page and I said I would bind those pages when I'm done with them with all those pages in this cover but I don't think I'm going to do that uh, not sure what to do but I think I'm going to uh, well this is these are four pages maybe I'm going to do it this way so two pages and I kept, kept them loose I'm not sure yet or I'm going to bind them could do that too I'm not sure but I think I'm going to do a soft cover around it so I can get them out you know what I mean just well, I have to fig figure that out yet, but, uh, well, not sure how to do that, but I will be back at the end when I um, have sewn all the pages I want to. And then when I do it that way, I can add more. Yeah, so I will make the other pages. And I think I keep them single. So pocket like this. And 
when I'm ready with all those pockets, I'll be back. So I'm back again. <laughs> I'm not ready. No, 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 I'm not. Uh, I was busy with the A4. And like I said, I um, sew the whole A4. I didn't do it until the end, until the end because it's a bit, well, it did do this, so I stopped here. But uh, when it succeeds, I sew it all the way up. And then, when I sewed it, I just think, well, I will cut it over there, pocket here, and I cut. it from the A4, like so. And then you have one pocket. Uh, now I have to sew the bottom and the bottom here. Uh, I could do that in one time and when it's still attached. Just sew here and sew here, but because the uh, plastic. Well, it's a bit wonky, so I'm going to do it this way. So now I'm going to sew this bottom and cut it here. Yes, I will do that off camera. But you can hear me sew. I sewed the bottom. Like here. Cut it again. There where I stopped. So this is a little pocket, that one could go there, and maybe you think, well, this is loose now because it's, well, not, uh, well, backward or forward sewing, but because you're going to glue it, it will stay put, I hope. So and now I'm going to sew this side or this side and this side and cut it a little piece off. So I will do that. But you only can do that with the A4 size when you don't have bigger paper. With the nine and a half inch size, well you have to do it one pocket at a time. And now the other side, because I didn't sew that yet. It's a bit wonky. But, uh, I don't care. So now I have this, sewn it, cutting the threads off. And now I'm cutting it straight. It should fit here, but I'm going to measure anyway. So this one here and I cut it over there. Um, like this. So 
but now I have my three pockets and I'm going to glue them in. You see? See you later. So I'm back. <laughs> I'm back with my book and I did it not the way I, uh, well, I said I would. I would, I should, um, sew them in this cover. That's what I said, but I didn't do that because it was too, well, too thin and I could change it, but I thought, well, let's do it this way and I show you why. I just took a piece of fabric and here are my pages and now they are all loose. And I think it's more uh, handy. I made oh, they fall one, two, three, four, five pages or five maps I made. And um, well, I have two with flowers and one with birds and birds and insects, I think, mushrooms and other animals and butterflies. And, uh, well, I can show them to you. So when I want to, uh, to search for flowers, well, I just take the flower map like this. Uh, I filled them already a bit and um, Well, these are little pockets I showed you, and these are three pockets, and this is a pocket two, and I'm putting that in, and two big maps, or big uh, sleeves, pockets, little ones, and this is something I'm not ready yet, but pockets and this pocket I just throw that in there and here I have flowers in like so. I prefer uh, vellum because vellum is uh, more sturdier, more uh, well it has more grip so it stays put much better. So this is for example this is with vellum and it's well this is going to be uh, floppy and this isn't. So these are the birds, oh I have more flowers. Uh, I did that the same except uh, I made a um, A4 pockets here and a little small one over there and I have to glue this. <laughs> I forgot to glue that, so I will do that. And here I have a big pocket and glued a little pocket on there, so I can do stuck uh, stuck some little stuff in there. And this one with and this one, oh, those two. with butterflies. Well I like it this way. So uh, just loose and I put them in here and then just a piece of fabric and a piece of silk. I think it's from a wedding dress or something like that. Uh, the piece of fabric, it's a um, very um, heavy fabric and um, I frayed it, I didn't sew it, just frayed it and now I can put this away. So that's it and if I want to search something I just them out 
throw this aside and then I can search for the things I want and I can make more and when I throw uh, sewing them in a book well you can't uh, make more if you know what I mean. Now I can make more maps and just pile them up and well I can do lots of it. So I like it this way. So I hope uh, well you liked it <laughs> and maybe you uh, got an idea for yourself. That's it. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.